And we're underway. Looking at these two men, I don't think there's going to be anything traditional about this one-on-one -on -one matchup. The only thing that would make this match more enjoyable to watch would be if I was calling it without you two bozos interrupting me. Ricky the Dragon Steamboat has defeated opponents of all shapes and sizes while holding several singles and tag team championships. Yeah, the lightning speed, the martial arts expertise, and the fire to go well beyond the limit. The Dragon has it all, Saxton. Ooh, what impact. Beautiful technique. Nailed it. Harsh impact. Tremendous impact. What a stop. Good grief. Oh, look at the beat out. Man, that hurts. Point of the elbow, nailed it. Oh, my goodness, this hurts. Oh, momentum not on the Nature Boy side. With these two guys, we all knew this was going to be an all out battle. He just has to make sure this doesn't get too out of hand for him. Sometimes, momentum has a way of permanently swinging one way. That's what he wants to avoid here. Most WWE champions had to overcome a single opponent to claim the biggest prize in the game. Some had to overcome a triple threat, a fatal four-way, or even five other men in the Elimination Chamber. But Ric Flair beat 29 other men to win his first WWE title at the 1992 Royal Rumble. Boom! <laughs> He's bringing it back inside the ring now. Michael mentioned Ric Flair's performance at the 1992 Royal Rumble. He literally outlasted everyone since he entered the match at number three as the first two entrants fought and was there to toss out the final competitor as well. That's true, Saxon. It's impressive to win the Rumble at any spot, but Ric Flair was in there with every single competitor and outlasted them all. It was a performance truly worthy of the WWE Championship. Boom, what impact! A knee drop! Oh, what a nasty, nasty move. Many consider Ric Flair to be the greatest world heavyweight champion of all time, the standard bearer by which all champions are measured. The Nature Boy also prides himself on being the... Uh-oh, position in. Measuring. In Not sure how much he has left. Hopefully, Ricky the Dragon Steamboat can recover. This is what makes him so dangerous. Yeah, he's one of the most energetic performers in WWE history. Byron brought up Ric Flair's nickname as the dirtiest player in the game. Even though Flair is beloved, he knew when to cut corners, whether it be pulling tights, wearing brass knuckles, or calling in backup like the Four Horsemen. It's not cheating if you don't get caught, Cole. And Ric Flair rarely got caught. He may be the dirtiest player, but he's also a winner. Big time atomic drop. I don't have you walking funny. Sharp knee. Tossed around like a rag doll. Oof. Here's the cover. No early kick out. Definitely has his work cut out for him. Look at Ricky the Dragon Steamboat making what a strike. Nice. Shut it down. He's a what a strike. Incredible. And the odds just swung in Ricky Steamboat's favor. Whoa, Ricky the Dragon Steamboat is setting it up. Yeah, I'm curious to see how long his stamina can hold here. You gotta believe this one's over. And the nature of the figure four leg Whoa. lock. But is it enough to end it? It appears Ricky Steamboat is starting to hit the wall. We might just have nothing left to give, guys. I don't know. Whoa, he gets out of it. He's at another level right now, Michael. Here's the dragon. Ricky the Dragon Steamboat. Sleeper hole applied. That might just be the final nail in the coffin. That'll leave you gasping for air, that's for sure. Boom! Big opportunity for the dragon here, guys. Ric Flair is in a real bad spot. Suplex! Looking for the finish. He doesn't look too eager to get up, and I don't blame him. This might be it. Oh, my. 
Ric Flair is getting a serious beatdown. Not sure how much more anyone would be able to take. Looks to me like he just hit a wall. He is hurt. The Nature Boy needs to rely on his trademark stamina right now. Ric Flair needs to rely on advice from Bot. That should do it right there. Oh, nasty impact. How does he keep doing this? You have to admire the fire burning inside Ricky the Dragon Steamboat with that kick out. Nito! Man, that hurts. He's making a statement here with this attack. What a stomp. Good grief. Oh, and that knee drop right to the jaw. If that doesn't end it, I don't know what will. Look at this. This could do it. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. Oh, clothesline! Oh, and a snap there! That'll give you a whiplash. Here's the dragon. Ricky the dragon steamboat! Creeper hole applied! The Nature Boy is in a tough spot here. Just as devastating the second time around. He releases it. And you can debate whether or not that would have been the end. Interesting decision. There's the pin. Can his opponent kick out? And he got a near fall out of it. Wow. Steamboat not in an ideal spot right now. I'm not sure how much more he has to give. This match is the figure four. To borrow a line from you, Cole, that's vintage Ric Flair right there. Let me tell you, that can cause some serious injury. It appears Ricky Steamboat is starting to hit the wall. He might just have nothing left to give, guys. This is all but over. Oh, man, he, he somehow breaks free. Nice, but he clearly has next to nothing left to give here. Ah, oh, setting him up. Sheet breaker! Oh, this is dangerous right here. Uh-oh, he's in trouble here. He can't withstand one bit more. Oh, dragon with a crossbody. Can he finish him off here? One, two, three. What can Ric Flair do here to up the odds for success? He's always up for a challenge, and tonight is no different. You've got to believe this one's over. Really working over the body. Oh, bell clap. And Ricky Sebo too quick that time. Absolutely sudden. Swinging neck breaker. Textbook. I don't like the look in his eye here, folks. Here we go, Ricky the Dragon. Steamboat is in position. He looks for it once again. Steamboat with a diving brain chop. Now it's time to capitalize. How in the world is Flair going to remain alive? He's got him covered. One, two, three. Yes, takes it. 